Oh, that, right, okay. Um, uh, time for a little British invasion.
take lessons from her. Um, so we, we took some lessons a little bit, once or twice, <laughs> for how many years? Yeah. Uh, and so uh, one of the things that's kind of mentioned this about each of us, we're trained singers, we took, we've taken years of lessons, lots of study. Uh, I like to say our current uh, voice teacher, whom we still take lessons with when we can, is about is 80 some odd years old and about this high, and is not afraid to tell us when we do everything wrong. <laughs> um, it's, it's, it's really hilarious. Um, and then she'll turn to our kids and say, oh, what are you doing? Aren't you having a great time? Or like, can't you be nice to us? <laughs> <laughs> but it's not what we pay her for. We pay, we pay her to, to kick us into shape. Um, and so I'm going to do a little folk song as well. Um, what's kind of fun that I don't think a lot of people understand is that, um, or maybe even know, is that classical composers have done a lot of arrangements of folk song material. Beethoven arranged folk songs, Irish folk songs, put it in German, and somebody asked him to do it and paid him. So if you're a composer, and somebody hands you some tunes and says, can you make an arrangement of this for a like, string quartet, and I will pay you, you're probably going to say yes, <laughs> right? So he said, yes, I will do this. If you give me money, I will do this. And so if you dig, I think Boston College has a really deep library of all this sort of stuff, of all these really cool folk <coughs> animations. Benjamin Britten was a British composer, active in the 1950s, 60s, 70s. Uh, classical composer, wrote operas like Billy Budd, Peter Grimes, uh, and such. But he also did a lot of folk song arrangements that were oftentimes sung and written for and sung by his husband, Peter Pierce. This is one of them. This is called The Ash Grove, and it's a Welsh tune, um, but I will not sing in Welsh. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs>
It ain't opera if somebody doesn't murder a <laughs> um, So this one, she's having an affair with somebody in the town that they're visiting. They're traveling, um, like, uh, performers. And you can kind of hear, like, the circus themes in here, too. Um, so listen for that, especially when, it, when the theme comes back around. Um, she's singing about the birds. And she's singing, it's a song that she sang as a child. But I think she's envious of the birds and their freedom in this particular. And I'm going to move this microphone because not <laughs> <laughs> Not need the um, microphone. That's true. I make my living primarily as a, as a voice teacher as well. Um, I <coughs> think when there's time, and um, most of what I do is teaching voice either at Penn State University or out of our home here in town. Um, but once upon a time, somebody said, "Oh, you're you're a voice teacher. So do you do you um, give your wife voice lessons and tips?" And I said, "No." <laughs> <laughs> Like being married. <laughs> I don't want to stay that way. Can you imagine? Oh, honey, that was a little bit. That was a little bit flat. I'm gonna flatten you. <laughs> so no, I don't at all. Uh, it's just not worth it. Uh, I really enjoy being married. Uh, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna change it up. Uh, if I can get the tablet to work. Uh, it, uh, uh, there you are. Um, you should all know this song once you start hearing it. Don't go changing. H O L. I think it's You never let me down before. I don't imagine. Good. 
some new fashion Don't change the color of your hair Always have my spoken passion <laughs>
I know who's got the talent and the charm around here. I know who sings the best. I know who. I know who has the brains. I know too, but what have you got? Woo! I got you, babe. <laughs> Cause you got me, and baby, I got you. Babe, I got you, babe. I got you, babe. They say our love won't pay the rent before it's earned, our money's all been spent. Well, I guess that's so we don't have a pot, but at least I'm sure of all the things we got. Babe, I got you, babe. I got you, babe. I got things in the spring. I got you. To wear my wreath And when I'm sad You're a clown And if I get scared You're always around So let them say Your hair's too long I don't care With you I can't go wrong Then put your Thank you. 
Don't forget to plug in. Oh, I did, yeah. Do you have Do you have a volume thing on your guitar? Um, yes. You can turn it up because I think it, it because it's all, it must be all the way down. No, it's, I'm picking it up now. I think. Yeah. All right. Next we got one of my mom's favorites, five foot two. She always played this on the piano. I was in the eyes of the moon. What those eyes were doing? And anybody see me like that?
Like a Piro is his little boat. Oh, yeah. And this man is in love. 
with a woman who we have right here today. She's going to have her two cents to say about all this. He can't wait to get on his little boat and go down there and see Yvonne and just take her away, just absorb her completely in his love. But there's a little bit of a catch because she has a little different angle on this whole deal. So we'll hear about She's going to do the female. Coming right up. I think it's Jen. Jen. Thank you. First, let me say welcome to Shawshank. 
I'll take care of it, don't worry. Treat me like a fool. Treat me mean good loving.
You can just grab that clutch and lower it if, if you need to. This is my wife, Don. Yes. Yes. I like her too. She's going to play a song that uh, she wrote. All righty. <laughs> One more. Wait, are you turn? You got to turn. Yeah. It's called these cheers. <laughs> Ooh. So who? So one person strum. I'm not sure. I, mean, I think I'm getting Gary, but I'm not getting Don. Right. Is that is that plugged in? And. And, and do you have your volume control in yours? Yes. You know what? You know, there it is. There it is. It's the O-N switch. <laughs> Donna's also a time for that. Sorry. 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 Sorry.
Welcome down. Ha ha, I'm the worst man. You got me down, up, up, down, any way you want me to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got me doing what you want me to do, baby. What do you want me to do?
and CIS reruns. Because <laughs> <laughs> we don't have a life. And, uh, <laughs> a singer-songwriter from LA, and she come out to Portsmouth, so you guys go see her. We'll cover this one a lot. Okay. Whew. Sort of bad hair day. This guy would be gone. <laughs> one, two, three, one, two. <laughs> Or either one or two, whatever you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's hope I remember the words. Thank you. 
maybe down in the lonesome town I can learn to forget Maybe down in lonesome town I can learn to forget the blinking blue button. I couldn't do this without you, but what do you say? How about we walk back in time together? Sounds good. Right now. Let's do it. <laughs> One for wow. the money. Four through. Whoa. It's good, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. Alright. Yeah. Boom, boom. Yeah. We'll start again. Start again, start again. Start again. Sorry about that. It's okay. My fault. <laughs> Two fingers crossed. Bad fingers. Bad fingers. <laughs> you do a great day. Yes, it is. And I forgot to ask, please, I know you guys know a lot of these songs. Yes. Sing along. Oh, we just have a good time. Let's finish up the evening together and just have fun here at North Rag, okay? Try it again. Boom, full of money. Two for the show. Three. Different song. Round, round, round the clock tonight. Put the brakes on. Join behind. Have some fun. When the clock strikes one, we're gonna rock. Round the clock tonight. We're gonna rock, rock, rock. In the broad daylight. We're gonna rock, gonna rock. Round the clock tonight. When the clock strikes two, three, and four. Start. You guys are 
terrific. Appreciate that. You know, a lot of you will remember that back quite a few years ago, there was a night the music died. We lost Buddy Holly and two other incredible musicians in the crash of a small plane. One of the other people was a radio DJ, J.P. Richardson from Texas, who we fondly loved as the Big Bopper. As the Big Bopper. This was one of my favorite songs that he did. Hello, baby. <laughs> yeah, this is the Big Bopper. <laughs> oh, you sweet thing. Well, I what? Can I what? Oh, baby, you know what I like. Chantilly legs and a pretty face and a ponytail hanging down. Wiggle and a walk and a giggle and a talk. Makes the world go round. There ain't nothing in the world like a big eyed girl to make me act so fun and make me spend my money. Goose like a long neck, goose like a girl. Oh, baby, that's what I like. What's that, baby? That's what I like. Button. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 but I. Oh, honey. Oh. All right, baby. Because you sure know what I like. Chantilly legs and a pretty face and a ponytail hanging down and a wiggle and a walk and a giggle and a talk makes the world go round. Ain't nothing in the world like a big eyed girl to make me act so funny, make me spend my money. Feel real loose like a long neck goose, like a girl. Oh, baby, that's what I like. What's that? Pick you up at eight and don't be late. <laughs> oh, honey, I, I ain't got no money. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right, baby, because you sure do know what I like. Chantilly lips and a pretty face and a pony tail hanging down. Wiggle and a walk and a giggle and a talk. Good Lord. Makes the world go round. There ain't nothing in the world like a big eyed girl to make me act so funny. Make me spend my money. Feel real loose like a long neck goose, like a girl. Oh, baby, that's what I like. Woo! Thank you. Thank you very much. There was an incredible, iconic songwriter back in the 50s who wrote for everybody else out in L.A. And one day, true story, his friend said to him, Bobby, I want you to write a song. I'll buy you the best timber in the world. If you can write a song, get it up into the top ten. And this time, you sing it. And he did that. Except the guy <coughs> said, but it has to start with the words. Split, splash. splash. <laughs> he did. It went to the top of the charts, and this was the first song Bobby Darren ever sang okay. on his own. Split, splash, I was taking a bath. Walk about a Saturday night. Yeah. Love the Dutch is relaxing in the tub. I was thinking everything was all right. I got that up the tub, I put my feet on the floor. Wrapped right up, got me, and I opened the door, and then I first spot, I got back in the back. My house, I knew there was a party going on. There was a wishing and a splash, and you knew the feeling, moving and improving, walking and a rolling. Hey man, they were just out there dancing, having fun. <laughs> Here we go. Bing bang, I saw the whole gang. They were a dancing on my little run. I get flip flop, they were doing a bop. All the teens had a dancing bop. Well, they were lollipop with Peggy Sue. Good morning, Miss Molly was in a man too. Well, this bunch, I forgot about the band. I 
died in that incredible plane crash. Can you remember who that was? Richie Valens. Richie Valens was just just past 14 years old. Oh. Brought Mexican music north across the border to us. It was spectacular, and he wrote this wonderful song, which he was performing. Uh, at the time of his untimely death, it's just all about a dance. The dance is called the Bamba. <laughs> Whisper 
Frank. 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 Keep three more. Okay. All righty then. Yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, he's. He... Okay. My story, and the first one I, we just uh, talked about, being at the drive-in theater. Well, the Everly Brothers gave us Aww. a wonderful song that expressed what we all were afraid of. <laughs> I'll be singing with myself on this track. Okay, no, wake up little Susie. Drive-in. Wake up little Susie, wake, wake up. up. Here she goes. Here we go. Wake up a little soon, you see, wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Keep hope and send to sleep. Wake up a little Susie and weep. The moon is over, it's four o'clock, and we're in trouble. Keep wake up a little Susie. Wake up a little Susie. Well, what are we going to tell you, Mama? What are we going to tell you, Pa? What are we going to tell our friends when they say, Ooh la la, wake up little Susie, wake up little Susie. Well, 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 told your mama that we'd be in by ten. Well, Susie baby looks like we moved again. Wake up little Susie, wake up little Susie. We've got to go home, home, home. Mm -hmm. Wake up a little Susie, wake up. Wake up a little Susie, wake up. The movie was so hot, it didn't have much of a car. We fell asleep, I grew six foot high. We had to ditch the shop, we go to the city. Oh, 
And I, I, I was packing up, and this guy about my age comes up as, as I'm going out to my car. He goes, nobody plays Dion anymore. That's <laughs> what <laughs> so he said to me. Dion Open air and music was a call. 
everything I rested In a field of emerald green I made my bed Oh, the lifeblood of a rat race still ran through me Paper bag novel, the kind a drugstore would sell. 
When you reach the part where the heartaches come, the hero would be me. But heroes often fail. If you won't read that book again, because the ending's just too hard to take. Walk away like a movie star who gets burned in a three way strip. Enter number two. A movie queen play the scene, bringing all the good things out in me. But for now, love, that's the real. I never thought I could act this way. Just like an old time 